hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to crochet this very cute hanging basket so grab your hooks and uh, prepare your materials and let's get started okay so we're going to start with the magic ring and then uh, six single crochets into the magic ring so one two three four five and six okay and then i'm going to place my marker over here so now in the second row we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we are going to increase and increase the next stitch too okay increase okay and you'll increase all the remaining stitches Okay, so now in our third row we are going to do single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet then increase in the next stitch and we'll keep repeating that single crochet and increase Okay, and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our fourth round we are going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches so we'll do two single crochets then increase in the next stitch and we'll keep repeating that two single crochet and increase and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our fifth row we are going to do three single crochets then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so three single crochets and increase repeat three single crochets and increase and keep repeating that all the way round okay so now in our sixth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 36 stitches so four single crochets and increase and you keep repeating that so four single crochet increase and repeat all the way round okay so now uh, in our seventh row we are going to do five single crochets then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 42 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and increase And repeat all the way round so five single crochet increase and repeat all the way to the end okay so guys after you're done with that now for the next 12 rows which is from row 8 to row 19 we are going to do single crochet in all the stitches in each row for a total of 42 stitches in each row 
okay so continue and do single crochets all the way until you get to the 19th row so i'll see you when you're done with the 19th row so that we start the 20th row together okay so guys after the 19th row this is how our little basket looks like as you can see in the inside too okay so you can add more rows if you want it to be taller so now we're going to start with the 20th row and for the 20th row uh, we're going to start by working in the front loops only okay so we'll do we'll start by doing 15 stitches in the front loops only so this is the front loop this is the back loop so we'll work in only this loop so we'll do single crochet one two three four five six seven and continue until you have 15 stitches okay so after you're done with the 15 single crochets so in the next stitch uh, we're going to do single crochets in the next two stitches okay so also we'll do single crochet so this one will work in both loops so single crochet and single crochet okay and then after that we are going to do a two double crochet in the next two stitches so we'll do two double crochet here and two double crochet in the next stitch okay so one double crochet and in the same stitch do another double crochet and then in the next stitch we're going to do the same thing so two double crochets in the same stitch okay and then now in the next four stitches we are going to do triple crochets so triple crochet you yarn over two times so triple crochet in the first stitch and then triple crochet in the next stitch Okay, triple crochet also in the next stitch and triple crochet in the next stitch so we have a total of four triple crochets okay so like that okay and then now in the next two stitches we're going to do double crochet in each stitch okay so we'll do double crochet in the next stitch so another double crochet Okay, so do uh, in the next stitch also do two double crochets like that okay and then after that we are going to do two uh, we are going to do a single crochet in the next two stitches Okay, so we'll do single crochet and single crochet 
okay and then after that now in the remaining 15 stitches we'll do single crochets so you continue and do single crochet single crochet single crochet and do single crochet all the way to the end okay so now we'll be working in a rows not rounds okay so when we reach it at a, at a certain point we'll be turning instead of continuing so now in our 21st row we are going to do a single crochet in the next 15 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and you continue until you have 15 single crochets okay so after you're done with the 15 single crochets we are going to turn and then after we turn uh, working right from here at the beginning we are going to do 30 single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and you continue counting until you have 30 single crochets okay so after you're done making your 30 single crochets now in our 23rd row we are going to do the same so we are going to turn and we are going to do 30 single crochets so you start and do single crochet one two three four five six seven and continue until you have 30 single crochets Okay, so after you get to the end you're going to turn and then we are going to do single crochet in the next five stitches so single crochet one two three four and five then we're going to decrease one time so you're going to go into the next stitch pull through and then going to the other stitch pull through so you have three loops on your hook and then pull through all the three loops okay and then after that we're going to do single crochet in the next seven stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five six and seven and then decrease and then we'll repeat that one more time so seven single crochets one two three four five six seven and decrease and then we'll do single crochet in the remaining five stitches so single crochet all the way to the end okay and then we're going to turn okay so now in our 25th row we are going to do single crochet in the next four stitches so single crochet one two three four and then decrease And then we're going to do single crochet in the next 13 stitches.
stitches so single crochet one two three four and continue until you have 13 single crochets okay so after the 13 single crochets we are going to decrease one time then we'll do single crochets in the remaining stitches okay so single crochet Okay, and the last one okay so after that we're going to turn so now in the next round we are going to do single crochet all the way around I mean until here for a total of 25 single crochets so we're going to do single crochet single crochet single crochet and continue until you have 25 single crochets okay so after we get to the end uh, we are going to turn again so now in our 27th row we are going to do uh, five single crochet then decrease and repeat that two more times okay so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and decrease and then we are going to repeat that again two more times so five single crochets and decrease one more time five single crochets and decrease And then you're going to do single crochet in the remaining four stitches okay and then we're going to turn so now in our 28th row we are going to do single crochets all the way until here so you'll have uh, 22 stitches okay so I'll see when you're done doing single crochets until here then we we'll start the next round together okay so when you're done with the 22 single crochets we are going to turn now in our 29th row uh, we're going to do single crochet in the next four stitches then decrease and repeat two more times so single crochet one two three four and decrease and repeat two more times four single crochets and decrease and the last time Four single crochets and decrease and then we do single crochets in the remaining four stitches Okay, and then we'll turn okay so now in our 30th row we are going to do single crochet all the way until here 
for a total of 19 stitches so you continue and do single crochets single crochet single crochet all the way until you get here okay so after you get to the end you're going to turn now in our 31st row we are going to do three single crochet then decrease and repeat two times so three single crochets and decrease and repeat two more times three single crochets decrease and one more time three single crochets and decrease then we do single crochet in the remaining four stitches okay and then we'll turn okay so now in our 32nd row you're going to do single crochet all the way until here for a total of 16 stitches Okay, so I'll see you when you're done with your single crochets and then we'll start the next row together. Okay, so after the 16 single crochets, we are going to turn. So now in our 33 row, we are going to do uh, four single crochet, then decrease and repeat uh, two times. Well, we are going to do that two times. So we're going to do single crochet one two three four and decrease and then we'll do that one more time so four single crochets and decrease Okay, so decrease okay and then we'll do single crochets in the remaining four stitches okay so it's a little bit tight Okay, and then we'll turn so now in our 34th row uh, we're going to do two single crochets and decrease and repeat that two more times so we're going to do single crochet one two and decrease So repeat that two more times. So two single crochets and decrease and two single crochets and decrease. And then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches okay and then we'll turn so now in our 35th row we're going to decrease five times okay so we're going to decrease one decrease two decrease three decrease four 
and decrease five and then we'll do single crochet in the last stitch Okay, and then we'll turn so in the 36th row which is the last row we are going to decrease three times so decrease the first time decrease again the second time and decrease the last time okay and then I'm going to go somewhere around here and slip stitch then we're going to cut off the yarn like that and then you're going to weave the ends so as you can see guys this is how it looks so this is the little mouth and this part here is the head so now we're going to make the eyes to put here on top Okay, so now for the eyes, I'm going to start with the, the eyeballs. So I'm going to use the white yarn and the 5 millimeters crochet hook. So we're going to start with the magic circle and do 8 single crochets into the magic ring. So 1, 2, 3, four five six seven eight okay and then i'm going to pull my yarn like that and place my marker over here okay so now in the second round we're going to increase each stitch round for a total of 16 stitches so we're going to increase okay so increase the next stitch two and increase and increase all the remaining stitches Okay, so after that now in the next two rounds which is row three and round four we are going to do single crochet in each round for a total of 16 stitches in each round okay so I'll see you when you're done uh, with the fourth round so that we do the fifth row together okay so after the fourth round this is how your eyeball should look like so now in our fifth row we are going to decrease all the way around for a total of eight stitches okay so we're going to decrease and then we'll continue decreasing all the way to the end okay so decrease all the way round okay so after you finish decreasing you're going to stuff the eyeball and then we're going to do our sixth row which is our last row and also we are going to decrease again all the way round Okay, so after we get to the end, we are going to slip stitch and cut off the yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, so after that, we'll make the outer part of the eye. Okay, so for the eyelid, we are going to use the green yarn and we are going to start by doing eight single crochets into the magic ring. So now in our second row, we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 16 
stitches so we are going to increase and increase also the next stitch okay and increase okay so continue increasing all the way round okay so after that now in our third and fourth row we are going to do single crochets all the way around in each row for a total of 16 stitches okay so do single crochets for the next two rows and then i'll see you when you're done the fourth row so that we do the fifth row together okay so after that now in our fifth row which is the last row we are going to do uh, 13 single crochets so we do single crochet one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and thirteen okay and then after that we are going to slip stitch and cut off the yarn like that long enough for sewing okay so now to put together the eyeballs is quite easy so what you do is uh, you put the eyeball inside the eyelid like this as you can see so here the longer side over here should be on top and the other one at the bottom okay so you're going to use this green yarn to sew all the way around until here okay so you have something like this okay so and then after that we are going to attach it on top here like this okay so i'll see you when i'm done attaching all the parts together okay so guys i finished attaching all the parts together as you can see that's how it looks like so i just hang it up so uh just to bring it a little bit closer over here so i attached the eyes right at the top and then i make I made that little chain so you can make it as long as you want then attach it right between the eyes and then I put a bottle of water inside as you can see and it looks so cute so guys I hope you enjoyed this pattern if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and also please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed until next time Bye.